All right, welcome to the Space Lutra Podcast slash video review of uh, I'm probably late to the game here, but it's the Star Wars Galactic Star Cruiser um, take. And this is my take, right? The Space Lutra take. So right off the bat, you've heard this all over and over, right? About how this is all wrong. So the only thing that basically is Star Wars is literally this. That's it. Everything else, as you heard in all the other videos, right? Um, is a bunch of crap like like this. But Space Lutra wanted to point out this. This here and this here is the reason I will never go to this thing. Ever. Because while everybody likes to point out the fact that, you know, like this, that they put this up, right? I'll tell you right now, Space Luchador has no interest at all at going anywhere at this place. There's nothing Star Wars about this. Matter of fact, it's an insult to say that it's um, Star Trek because it ain't even that. Oh, not to mention this thing here. It's another reason why I will ne look at this and this is a concept part I just I don't want to be here at all you know oh this is a perfect uh, again you know real quick just my 10 cents on it nothing that you haven't heard before right but this here Chewbacca is literally the only thing about this that's Star Wars and maybe this but Look, look at this. There's a kid in the middle of a grown-up fight talking trash. Then there's kids over here hassling Chewbacca, right? They're, like, whooping his ass like he's some sort of mascot, which he is at this point, right? Disney bought the rights, and now look at him. Pathetic. So anyways, there's nothing here to do for real adults. Like, this is... I will never pay to do this. Like, this is whack. At all levels. There you go. Saw that. And look at this. Look at look at the hands. Like this. This is the fakest thing. Forget about cringe. It's just the fakest damn thing I've ever seen. Look at this guy. Really? This thing here. Uh, you know, at the very best is giving me and even the uh the singing but it's giving me the uh uh, fifth element vibe. That's what it gives me. This ain't Star Trek. This ain't of generic space, whatever. These little consoles, they're all literally, and uh, this is probably, you know, I'm sure someone else has pointed it out, right? But this console here is the exact same console as this one, and this one, and this one, and this one here, and that one. It may be the only one that's different. It's the one that has that, um, that little uh, lever to do the hyper jump thing which again if <laughs> i wouldn't no, like no there's nothing attractive about this at all look at this i mean maybe the, the buttons there you know but again i ain't gonna pay a buttload of money to push a couple buttons as a bunch of buttload of people right stand there behind me and give me three seconds to push the damn buttons and look at this like it's so fake. And then this. This gives me. I want nothing to do with it. Oh, oh again. I want to. Uh, this is going to suck. But I'm probably the only one. That's going to straight up point out. This here. Is another reason. I have nothing against. Handicap. I want to state that. You know. Before anybody gets butt hurt. But. This is. It, it, it's This puts you out of what we're doing here like it's it's been lost you know what i mean like this is not what anybody wants and i'm pretty sure this person don't want it either uh, this ain't authentic this is fake that's the biggest thing of them all look at this a scarf really oh, there there you go the big jump spoiled right there none i don't want nothing to do with it that simple um, I don't really care if 
Disney pulling through or not pulling through, if they're gonna make it through or not make it through, like, I just don't care, to be honest, you know. But look at this. And then this is depressing. It's like, right there, wheelchair. Again, another dude. One chick, and then this guy has the audacity to like, here you go. Now shut the hell up. <laughs> and he's looking at him. He's like, oh, well, I guess. Fifth element, once again. This is pathetic. There's two empty seats. If you go anywhere in the world, no matter what show you're looking at, if there's empty seats, you know it sucks. This chick's fake. And it, it, you know, fifth element. I almost want Bruce Willis to come in here. You know, this this chick gets shot and he has to pull the uh, the fifth element stones, right? Or the element stones to save the universe. That was fake, cringy. There's two chicks. And there you go. It's these faces is the reason. I refuse to go because, you know, it just everything about it is the very thing I hate about media today in movies, in entertainment, you know, anything period. Like we're living in the worst era of entertainment ever. Like this is the end of day stuff. Think of this. Straight up, like, I could have done this, you know. Two-night adventure, really? On this thing? Well, you know, it is what it is. And there you go. And then and then, on top of all that, you know, I'll be the first to say, there's, there it is, Walt Disney, label of death, you know, destroys everything that Star Wars ever was, and I ain't giving them a pass for those shitty-ass movies. So there you go. Um, ain't much more you can say, pretty much. That's it. This here, this is what I'm talking about. It's like, this is not inviting. This is like, it's just whack beyond belief. And then the rooms, like this is what they had to, this is what they had in mind, like this is it. Oh, and this, you know, this, this is, this is depressing. It really is. It seems like there ain't shit. It's just literally the entrance of a, you know, one of those high end hotels and stuff. But all you have is the entrance. Then there's nothing in the back. It, you know, this would work better like as Jurassic World, maybe. Erase this shit, put some Jurassic World label here. A fence up. A couple dinosaur noises and shit, and there you go. Jurassic World. But yeah. You know, this is what they should have gave us. Right here. Gritty, right? Throw your damn luggages on the side. There you go. Some fat dude greeting you to Star Wars. Uh, fucking hotel, right? He's like, all right. Now that I have you, I have you uh, settled. Right? What do you want to be? And then, you know, you go from there and shit, right? Well, I'm going to be a Sith Lord, right? Even Harry Potter did it right. Harry Potter land, like, you know, it gave you four fucking houses to choose from. And this is what you, this is what Disney gives you. This is it. Oh, and give us all, all, all sorts of fucking money as we rape your childhood like we already did. Only now we're going to rape your sorry ass. Now I know that word suck, you know one of those no no words but whatever look at this like this is amazing now let's visit the damn thing all right get this out of the way shit oh, there we go now check this out there's nothing about this damn picture that's star wars don't be deceived by this shitty looking uh, black, I guess, uh, R2-D2, black silver. Uh, of course, they're going to have the girls running around. Look at this. 
You got a girl smuggler, a girl Jedi, or a little girl. You got another girl over here, another girl over here, another girl. <laughs> it's like, it's amazing. Look at this. And what's this guy? Supposed to be a bad guy? It's the shittiest villain ever right back here. Just to remind you what they think of you and now all the little, all the shit you've ever, all the hope you've ever had for the new Star Wars went down the shitter right there. Look at this. Can't even design a good ship. And the only fucking thing about Star Wars is Chewbacca. There he is. Sell out. <laughs> Can't believe it, man. This is, so there you go. There's not much more you can say. Sum it all up into 10. I will never visit there. You know, maybe for free, but that ain't gonna happen. So there you go. Uh, Space Lucha out on this quick, I don't know if uh, rant slash review, whatever the hell, prediction. Look at this. This is, this is, this is what pisses me off. It's this. They literally sat around with their heads up their ass and thought of this. Like, how the hell do we ruin Star Wars even more than we already did? Oh, I know. Right? Get a bunch of fucking people that no no don't know a damn thing about actual fucking legacies and franchises and actual fucking entertainment. Have them build their version of Star Wars. And this is it. Just a bunch of women running around thinking that they can actually lightsaber duel, right? The shittiest version of a villain ever. And, there, and there's Chewbacca, just to remind you. Oh, yep, there he is. That's the last fucking thing left of the old school Star Wars. So there you go. Space Loot right on this one. Uh, big fuck you to Disney for doing what they did. And there you go. Um, Nothing much you can say. So, space to try out. See you in the next one.